I think they're gone. <laughs> what the hell? Didn't mean to grab you so hard. Tears. A chiral allergy. So, you have dooms, like me. I've got the extinction factor, but I think you got me beat. What's your level? You can see them, right? No, but I can sense them. Level two, then. What are you doing here? Trying to stay dry. Same as you. Time falls that up. My name is Fragile. Yeah, I've heard of you. <laughs> that right? Some Porter Bridges. The man who delivers. work for me? Must be tough out here on your own. Yeah, I thought Fragile Express had plenty of people. Plenty of traitors. Not much left of us now, save for a few of us folks. And on top of that, not much left of me either. Got soaked from neck to toe. I can't help you with that. I make deliveries. That's all. This is Bridges Central Dispatch. Freelance contractor Sam Porter Bridges. Receiver is standing by for drop. Headed into town. Watch yourself. Those things never stay gone for long. Time for fast forwards, whatever it touches. But it can't wash everything away. The past just won't let go. I'll see you around. Sam Porter Bridges.
Bridget Strand is dead. America's last president dead and burned. Oh, and now the girl's been chosen to take mommy's place. Well, that won't wash. She's not cut out for politics, is she? Oh, but don't worry. I'll find her. And I'll keep her real safe. <laughs> you see, I've come to understand the truth of the Death Stranding. Oh, there's so much you people don't know. The girl, for instance. She's not like you or me. Dooms ain't her thing. And she's more into destruction on a worldwide scale. An extinction entity. Oh, it's so hard to form connections when you can't shake hands. Fortunately, I've got a good connection to the other side. Now you... You're no bridge. But me... I'm bound to all of it. This world, that world... And our sweet little angel of death. what you've been waiting for this whole time? A game over. Through then. I don't break that easy. Name notwithstanding. You saw that asshole too, right? Higgs. He's the leader of a separatist group. Seemed to me like he was controlling that BT. That's a level seven for you. Higher, maybe. Seems like you know a lot about him. Used to work together. Guess you could say we had a contract. You did business with terrorists? Whoever pays, huh? He wasn't like that back then. So what's your angle? You want to save the world, or you want to fuck it all up like him? I wish I... I just wish things were different, all right? Here's all right. Don't worry, she still floats. Come on, we're the only cargo left. We should get there tomorrow.
I told you before, Sam. The past just won't let go. Listen, I have something to ask of you. It has to do with that asshole, Higgs. Do you remember? It's almost time to go, Sam. I had no idea until you told me. No idea that I was alive. Living is no different from being dead if you're all alone. I don't want to go home. Here, it's a dream catcher. Wear it when you sleep, and I'll keep the nightmares away. I'll always be with you. Did you forget how to go home? Come on. I'll take you halfway. And then you can do the rest by yourself. Better now? I'll be waiting for you on the beach. Come and find me. We used to play together a lot in this place. You brought me here. I couldn't make the trip on my own. So long as you have a body to return to, you can't come and go as you please. So you can't just come back east through here? Not until you make us whole again, Sam. I'll be waiting for you, on the beach. Come and find me. I don't know how you sleep. Need to pick me up? <sighs> Welcome to Lake Knot City. What? Nothing. 
Let's go. This cargo is from Port Nut City, bound for Lake Knot. I'll leave these up to you. The dispatch terminal is up ahead. In the meantime, I've got some business to attend to. Later, alligator. Something to eat? Why are you here? Ask your boss man. No. I mean, why are you here? Got a delivery for a porter. You're gonna need this on the road ahead. This will ID you as an associate of Fragile Express. It's woven from my blood and chiral crystals. Think of it as a kind of bond. Preppers around these parts won't give you trouble so long as you've got it. We were the only people making deliveries out here. This was our territory. Until Higgs fucked it all up. Me? The Express? Our reputation? All of it. And now you want to fuck them back? On your own. I'm not on my own. The cave. Port not seedy. Next to your bed. So far apart, yet somehow we keep meeting. All that BT country in between where I should have been caught in a void out. Yet here I am. Here I am. You can use the beach? I have a beach. You've got yours. I've got mine. I use it to jump across space. I can't conjure up BTs the way Higgs can. But I can go after him. Chase him to the beach. Problem is, everyone's got their own way in. I'm only allowed to pass through the beach I know and understand. I'm sure you've heard the term multiverse. You all right? The jumps take a lot out of me. Suck my blood dry. You're going to Edge Not City, right? Place is full of terrorists. But if you're dead set on it, then you're gonna have to deal with heat sooner or later. Look, I make deliveries, killing monsters and terrorists. It's not what I do. What if we did it together? I could use my power to help you. We don't have to want the same thing to be on the same side. I could send you across my beach to any place the Kyrelians thick enough, any place connected to the Chiral network. And what do you expect in return? I expect you to think it over. Here. Call it an incentive. And call me if you need me. This will keep us connected. See you when I see you.
Sorry, didn't mean to startle you. You were sleeping when I dropped by. Thanks for the shower. All right. Look, I gotta ask. I've been hearing things about you. She's in bed with terrorists. Don't trust her. She's just another dumbass Higgs fucked over. She's a goddamn hero, that woman. Tell me, Sam, what does America mean to you? The way my dad made it sound, we were something special. The glue that held it all together. More than a nation. A symbol of freedom and hope. We could bring it all back if we kept on making deliveries and connecting people. He was sure of it. I was a wreck after he died. That's when Heeks made his pitch. Together, we can run packages from sea to shining sea. Back then, he had a monopoly west of here. We both stood to gain a lot from a partnership. Business was pretty good at first. But then, a year ago, when those fanatics started stirring up trouble, fuckers hijacked our system. Somehow, they got a hold of our security passes and used them to sneak into cities. And just like that, we're delivering guns and bombs instead of medicine, and I didn't even know. We were just cogs in a terrorist machine. Higgs was behind it all. And on top of that, he got his hands on an old-school nuke that I ended up carrying riding to Middle Knot City. You tell me, then? Yeah. It was me. I blew it up. Could have been different if I wasn't so fucking blind. So I did everything in my power to stop South Knot City from getting destroyed. I tried to get the nuke out of the city. But Higgs was one step ahead. He took his pound of flesh and then some. Some wounds. They don't heal. Whatever time I've got left, the rain took. So there you have it. Everything's true, except for all the lies. I don't give a damn about bridges or putting America back together. But I'm not about to let Higgs and some terrorists take my father's legacy and shit all over it. That's why I came to you. So, trust me now. I'll be there for you, Sam. All you have to do is call. Sam Bridges, I presume? It says here the client is fragile herself. Careful, the contents are fragile. Son of a bitch, it was him. What are you talking about? The package I picked up for you, the one from Lake Knot. Hold on, I wasn't expecting any package. He said Fragile herself was the client. The system was down, so some bridges delivery guy had to hand it over in person. Who? Look, the point is, it was Higgs. Come on, I need to see it now.
It's a nuke! Not again. The bastards can't do this to me again. The timer's already started. I can't stop it. We only have one option. Sam, you've got to get rid of it. Take it down to the crater next to South Knot. It's a tar pit. Damn your bottomless. If we chuck it in there, we just might have a chance. Jesus, that was close. You saved the city and everyone in it. I love a lot more than I ever did. Maybe there's no way of saving Middle Knot. But South Knot's still here. Because of me. And you. By the time I realized what Higgs was planning, the nuke was already at the city gates. I followed the delivery truck and somehow managed to carry the bomb to safety. But Higgs had been on to me from the start. He caught me red-handed outside the gates, nuke still cradled in my arms like a child. So, as punishment, he strips me down to nothing, and then he makes it rain. Listen up, fly drive. I got a proposition for you. Do you want to live out your days as damaged goods? Or would you rather take damage for the goods? Get to the point. All right. If all you want is to save yourself, you just have to jump. However, if you want to see this altruistic streak of yours through, then you'll have to carry my nuke to the bottomless pit and toss it in. Oh, sure, you'll be the city savior. But you will have to walk naked through Timefall to do it. Trade a lot of your time for a little bit of the city's? <laughs> Hell, seems like a fair exchange to me. Is I don't much care for my face. That's why I hide it. Oh, but you. Oh, you 
just love yours, don't you? I bet Daddy was real proud. Oh. Don't worry. I won't mess it up. See, I want your face to be a kind of testament. Why did you do it? Why did you betray me? Because I found someone who completes me. Someone who doesn't need me to wear a mask. Oh. <clears throat> Word to the wise. Even if you do save South Knot, You'll always be the nut job who blew up Middle Knot. Oh, and that pretty face of yours will always be remembered as the face of a terrorist. They'll never stop hunting you. Believe me, I know. Well, they can slap a sticker on you, but you're still gonna break in transit. Oh. So... What's it gonna be? Hmm? I'll take the damage and the goods. I don't break that easy. <laughs> ah, well, good luck with that. I'll take the damage. I don't break that easy. I'll take the damage and the goods. I don't break that easy. Damn hero. He did the right thing. This belongs to you. I'm no hero, Sam. That choice I made, I've regretted it ever since. All I had to do was jump, and I could have saved myself. But instead, you saved a city. And more than that, you gave people hope. Well, now there's only one person left for me to save. I'm gonna make Heats regret he ever crossed me. By killing him? Can't. He's way more powerful now than he was before. But you could take him. You could. But promise me. Promise me you'll leave him alive. There's something I want to ask him to his face. I didn't think you were capable of torture. I'm now. 
And I want to know why he betrayed me. Do you want it? Don't forget about the supply run to South Knot City. Higgs wants to connect the knots of your network with Amory's Beach. So it's pretty clear where they went. So how do we get there? I can't. But you and Emily have a strong connection. You've been to her beach plenty of times, right? You can make the jump. You gonna come through for me? I'll try to take him alive. Promise me, I'm the one who finishes him off. Good. Then I'll help you get where you need to go. I can send us both at once. But I'll be right behind you. I thought you said you couldn't go to her. I can't. But I can go to you. By the ties that bind us together. The Dreamcatcher will lead you to her. And then? The Misonga will lead me to you. For going in like that? Yeah, I don't need a weapon. I'm not gonna take Lou either. Fragile. What? Do you have anything to eat? Oh. Got you hooked, huh? <laughs> Sam, be careful. Worst comes to worst, take care of Lou, all right? this to work. I'll have to touch you. Close your eyes. Now picture Amelie in her beach. You love her, right? You love her. There it is. Touchy feely there, Mr. Often Phobia. <laughs> well, congratulations. You won the game.
Too bad you didn't stop shit. Well, get on with it. Guess I left a lasting impression. I'm fragile, but I'm not that fragile. This time you're the one who's going to break. Is that right? I think you'll find our bond is made of stronger stuff. Already broken. What the fuck? I'm Higgs. I'm the particle of God that permeates all existence. What are you? Honey, you ain't nothing but damaged goods. You are damaged goods. What took you so long? I brought you a metaphor. Take it with you. Tell the lifers with Porter Syndrome what happens when you hide behind the mask. No. You keep it. It's better they hear it from the woman herself. One more thing. Your little one managed to bring it here by picturing it as equipment. You mind? Babysitting sucks. So where should I send you? Back east? He doesn't need your help. He's got the Chiral Network. And he's got me. We can jump east together. Lucky him. We appreciate everything you've done for us. We really do. But we're good for now. Besides, I'm sure they need you back at Fragile Express. Yeah. We better to scoop up all the pieces and put them back together. Wouldn't want to settle for anything less than perfection. Fragile. We're square. Nothing owed. Nothing left to say. So long, Sam. Come on. Let's go. We still have work to do. Do you still believe in me? Even without Higgs, I am a walking time bomb. 
I can end it all just like that. But what I want, what I have always wanted was to be a part of it. For us all to be one. What? Tell me the truth. Was this all for you or all for Bridget? This is for our country. For our future, that is the truth. There's something that you need to know, Sam. When you were back east, I slipped out of here and I went to visit you. What? Did you lie? Fuck me. You have any idea what it took for me to get here? You wouldn't have come if I hadn't. You didn't care about America or bridges. But we did know one thing you did care about. Something you were willing to cross a continent for. A reason to build the UCA. It was Die Hard Man's idea. Great. So I'm Mario and you're Princess Peach. Are <laughs> you right? I never gave a shit about this country. I have no ties to anything or anyone but you. I'm so sorry, Sam. But it all worked out in the end. Well, I guess that's taken care of. I know you have questions, but can you save them for after? Sure. Let's go home. How do we do it? Do we jump like fragile? No. The beach goes the whole way. We run together. Run? Yeah. Like Mario and Princess Beach. Sam, uh, are you okay? I reviewed your logs. It looks like you were caught in a supercell and emerged an instant later on the other side of Ground Zero. Not far from Port Nod City. How'd I wind up here then? Remember Victor? He found you lying unconscious by the harbor and brought you inside. I think Cliff might be Lou's father. He said... Give me back my BB. Impossible. Cliff was born. He gave me this. Maybe he's trying to tell us something. Something about the BBs, maybe. About how they were made. It didn't feel like he was trying to hurt us. It felt like... Like he just wanted to talk. But you said you saw him holding the director captive on the beach. Yeah. They must have some history we don't know about. That man, Bridget. Funny you should say that. I've got something you should see. Found it in the archives while I was digging around. It's a pre-recorded message from the director labeled, If I Don't Come Back. This message is insurance, in case something happens to me. For Bridget's eyes only, and I sure as hell hope that's who's watching. I got a little present from Emily. Said she'd take me to the beach if I wanted. But I'd need this doll to show me the way. It's a trap. It has to be. But I've decided to play along. 
You've all been playing along too, haven't you? You know this mask hides more than just my face. Well, Emily's a blank slate too. No past, no record she ever existed. She's a ghost. And the thing about ghosts, I never met Emily in person. Have you? Ever seen her in the flesh, shook her hand, touched her? The original team we sent was divided into two groups. Emily was with the first, Mama and Hartman were with the second. They had no direct contact with her. Yes, Amelie's group was wiped out in Edge North City. Everyone but her. Everyone who could say whether or not she exists. Bullshit. She's real. We touched, all right? She and I both. Well, I've only ever interacted with her hologram. I'm telling you, I've met her in person. Lots of times when I was little. Yes, but on the beach. Here's what the president had to say about her daughter. Emily was born on the beach. There her ka remained, though her ha came to this world. This division of body and soul forced her to spend most of her childhood in the hospital. But though her health was poor, her doom's numbers were off the charts. Her supernatural talents blossomed as she grew older and overcame her limitations. But by the time she was 20, she could travel to and from the beach, body and all. And that's where she started spending all of her time. Now, if you wanted to get in touch with Emily, it was via hologram or nothing. The president insisted on that. I swore an oath to the president and to America. As far as I was concerned, her word was law. So when she said Emily was her daughter and the best candidate to succeed her, I believed it. But when the archives were restored, I couldn't resist testing out my access privileges. And that's how I found out. Bridget was diagnosed with uterine cancer in her 20s and couldn't have children. You see, doesn't add up, does it? There's no way Emily could be Bridget's biological daughter. So where'd she come from? Who is she? Is she even real? How can we be sure that Emily is an extinction entity when we don't even know if Emily is Emily? Hell, for all I know, the EE theory might be bullshit. But if it's not, if she's the cause of the Death Stranding, then I have to accept her invitation. I've loaded my gun with hermetic rounds. Sam's blood. It connects my gun to her, to me, to him, all of us. Which means I should be able to take it with me to the beach. I'm gonna stop what she started by stopping her. One last confession. I'm just a man. No powers, nothing special. Don't have dooms, I can't repatriate like Sam either. Don't know the first thing about dying, I had never tried it. Yeah. I've been to hell. Every single battlefield was hell. But no matter how terrible it got, I never died, because all I ever did was run from death. Well, I gotta go. She's calling for me. Bridges, don't let me down. After he recorded this, the director jumped to the beach. 
Or rather, Amelie summoned him there. He had a gun to Bridget when I saw him. Then Cliff showed up, took him away. I thought he went to the beach to confront Amelie. Yeah, she was there too. She was the one who got me out. Huh. It's so obvious to me now. I can't believe I didn't see it sooner. It was Amelie who... What happened? The chiral network dropped out. According to Lakna, it won't be long before it's completely unusable. So all our hard work was for nothing. Let me finish what I was saying, Seth. I'll tell him. Fraja, you look like shit. You should be resting. I know. I need to tell you something. I had a little chat with Higgs back on the beach. Didn't take much to make him talk. He say why he betrayed you? He said it was part of her plan. What? She was their leader. The terrorist void outs, the whole extinction agenda, Amelie was behind it all. Like how she was? I know you don't want to believe it, but it lines up with what Die Hard Man said. He's turned on me after he met Amelie. At first, he was looking to expand his territory, and I had a power he could use. At least, that's how he ended up working with me. He was no terrorist. He just wanted to reach more people. But then she shows up with abilities that put mine to shame. Hell, she could even control BTs. So Higgs decides to go with her. And that's when she turned him into her agent of extinction. Amelie gave Higgs his power? Yep. She made him her homo demons. What about Bridget? You could have tell me what she was doing on the beach? You got an answer for that, too? I know it's a lot to swallow. But he said himself that Amelie is an extinction entity. I looked inside his pod, and there was no BB in there. Take a good look at what was. It's the same doll Die Hard Man had. This is their bridge baby. There's this idea that the terrorists brought back BB Tech and Bridges was just following suit. It's garbage. Their methods and yours are completely different. Your BB links you to the world of the dead. Their doll links them to Amelie and her beach. You know who else had dolls like this? Cliff. He was carrying them on the battlefields. Cliff, Higgs, the director, all three of them were drawn in and controlled by this extinction entity. And who is this EE -E really? Is it Rigid? Is it Amelie? All I can say is that the answers are on the beach. What she wants and why. If we get to the bottom of that, then maybe we can still avert the last stranding. You've got to find her, Sam. Whoever she really is. <sighs> She's waiting for you on the beach. Hurry back east. Sorry, didn't mean to startle you. Where am I? Back east of the tar belt. Your private room. You have Amelie to thank for that. Where is she? We don't know. She didn't head back east? No, but after she saw to you, she contacted HQ and left us a message. Saying what? I'm going to finish what Bridget started. Just that, and then... gone. Bridget? I saw Bridget on the beach. Sam, please. You yourself burned her body, remember? She wouldn't have remained on the beach. Couldn't have. Not even if it was her daughter's beach. Check the logs. You've got them, don't you? Sorry. We didn't get any of it. The only record we have is the one in your head. What else do you remember? That guy was there, too. Cliff. He took Die Hardman hostage. The director? That part you believe? Well... 
It would explain why we haven't heard from him for so long. I always suspected him. But now I'm starting to piece together a different narrative. Something's been bothering me, you see. We've been operating on the assumption that Higgs was controlling Cliff. But that can't possibly be correct. Because Higgs is gone. And Cliff is still causing trouble. You think Cliff is the mastermind? Yes. He's likely holding Amelie and the director captive on the beach. And that's where I'm going. Wait a minute. Where's Fragile? She's safe here with us. But so long as you're over there, she won't be able to send you to the beach. What? You must understand, Sam. While you were unconscious, the situation changed quite a bit. We'll explain everything, I promise. But first, you should rest. All right? Fuck rest. I'm going back to that beach. And little Lou doesn't need a break either, I take it? Ugh. <sighs> Sam, you helped us extend the chiral network from coast to coast. And you dealt with Higgs, the UCA's enemy number one. We couldn't have come this far without you. But there is still one final step. We have to swear in a new president and establish a functioning government. Only then will America be whole again. Why don't you save that shit for someone who cares? I've done my part, fuck America. We've got bigger problems now. I hear you, Sam. Government is the least of our concerns at this point. Cliff has Amelie, which means there may not be anything left to govern come tomorrow, if tomorrow comes at all. Then why aren't we out there doing something about it? I don't care what she is, only that we get her back. Right you are. Rescuing Amelie and averting the sixth extinction are one and the same, but neither will be possible unless you first Come back east. We are in no position to give you orders, of course. But believe me when I say it is the only way. Sam, everyone's here but you. Fragile transported us back to headquarters. Are you okay? Uh, never been better. Oh. Oh. Delivering so many people in such a short amount of time is... No. Mama. No, no Lochner. Yeah, I'm here too. Figured I should lend a hand. We're all waiting for you, Sam. No way in hell am I hauling myself all the way back there. Come on, Fragile. Let's do this. I can't, Sam. And not just because I'm a wreck. It isn't safe to use the beaches to move people anymore. <laughs> Chiral spikes have become far more frequent, possibly as a result of expanding the network nationwide. Too many beaches sharing the same space, wires get crossed and so forth. You can see the toll it's taking on the network itself. With things the way they are, it's too dangerous to risk jumping through a beach. Even if I reach a beach, there's no telling where I'll come out on the other side. And I could get stuck in there. That's why I can't go to you either. But if I could get to the entrance of the beach, I should be able to get you there. The beaches are still there after all. I can personally attest to that. So yeah, you will need to hold yourself all the way back here. But once you have, I promise I'll take you to Amelie, straight to her beach. The two of you share a very special connection. Your dream catcher, her kipu. They are no mere trinkets. They are singular, irreplaceable totems, embodiments of your shared memories. Two sides of a coin. The price of entry to her beach. Dream catchers are a product of Native American tradition, that of the Ojibwe people, to be precise. 
They were said to ward off nightmares, to alter one's dreams. If Dooms is indeed Amelie's gift to us, her shared dream of our future, perhaps your totem is an invitation to change it, a test challenging you to find hope amid their hopelessness. While we await your return, I'll search the beach for Amelie and the director. I doubt my ties to them are strong enough, but better that than sitting around doing nothing. I'll see if I can't find something in the records on the three of them. Maybe they're more connected than we know. We're waiting for you. The way home should be easier, right? Hurry back east. You already know the way. And when you get here... Oh. Oh. Finders keepers. Now, get out of there. And make sure you head east, towards Lake Knot City. There's no cargo to deliver this time. Or rather, you're the cargo. That's the mission. Gross. You're back. It must have been one hell of a journey, especially on your own. But now the whole team is together again. The whole team? Die Hard Men too? Too much traveling to and from beaches in such a short span. Chiral matter contaminated her cells, effectively causing jet lag on a molecular level. Because of that, her homeostatic mechanisms were shaken. Don't worry, she's not in any danger, but she needs some rest. So where's the director? He's being looked after in another room. Bridges personnel found him lying outside the isolation ward, similar to when you came back from Cliff's Beach. <sighs> Even after decontamination, she needed more and more time to recover. You made it. Hungry. Thanks. Looks like you need me after all. Who'd have thought? Ticking. Am I right? Sam's here. The great deliverer. The only one who can reach Amelie's beach. Uh, oh. You're in no condition to do this. It's not fair to you or Sam. Uh, um, in my own search for Amelie's beach, I have come to realize something extraordinary. If beaches were likened to a multiverse, Hers would appear to exist on a higher plane than ours. I can walk the beaches of others, but hers is beyond my reach. It's invisible, <laughs> inaccessible, even to fragile, I fear. Uh, imagine it as a circulatory system, if you will. Each of our beaches is a single capillary, but Armelie's beach is the heart that pumps blood to the rest of us. Capillaries are subordinate to the greater whole, a whole governed by the heart, which gives direction, which dictates flow, which dictates everything, controls everything. Don't you see? She is in control. You may be able to travel against the flow and reach her, but having done so, 
If she does not wish to let you go, if she wishes to keep you, she can. Fragile and Die Hardman broke free from her beat, didn't they? I don't think it was any different from what happened to you. I didn't get out because I wanted to. I was forced out, repatriated, if you will, by her. Forced out? Why? <clears throat> this is only a theory, but... She wants you. Wants you to go to her. That's her final wish, don't you think? So that's it, huh? Amelie's the EE, -E and this is her endgame. Just so we're clear, if I want to stop the last stranding and come back in one piece, I need to go to her beach and talk her out of it. That about right? Correct. As cliche as it sounds, you're our only hope. Though quite frankly, I doubt even you can change her mind. If you can't make her see reason, you'll have to kill her. And if you kill her... You'll save the world, but you'll be stranded outside of it. Forever. as well make it official then you ready to deliver the package I'll talk to her maybe she'll listen but with the shape the world's in it will only be delaying the inevitable still if it buys us time to try and build something better, a new lease on life, at least for a little bit. Well, I can think of one woman who made the most of a chance like that. Nothing lasts forever, not even the world. But we gotta keep it going as long as we can, right? Patch the holes, change the parts, all that. So we can say we had a good run, that we lived. I thought you didn't like having to handle things with care. Because it was hard enough keeping my own shit together. Back when we met at the cave, the only thing I cared about was making it to the next sunrise. Sure as hell didn't care about America or the future. I was living a lie, hung up on past regrets. I was broken. But somewhere along the way, I started changing. I started meeting people that made me think that maybe it wasn't all bad. People that put their faith in tomorrow, and in me. That kept the lights on, and waited for hope to arrive. So I gotta deliver, for their sake. Even if it means you never come back? Fucked if I do, fucked if I don't, right? care of Lou. I will. Couldn't find a working still mother east of Port Knot City. Kid's done enough. No more. All right. I'll do my best to nurse our little one back to health.
Okay, concentrate. Help me look for Emily. Reach for her, Sam. Feel her. I know you love her. You love her! Weather. Don't think you'll be needing an umbrella. I decided to follow my father's dream after all. Don't worry, I won't get mixed up with any terrorists this time. UCA's got my back. We're the first private delivery company to get the official approval. Sounds like you're moving up in the world. Congratulations. Thanks. Wait, there's something I have to tell you. I didn't shoot Higgs. Couldn't pull the trigger. So I let him choose. Death or eternal solitude on the beach. Well, fair enough. You never did like breaking things. That's right. I find and fix what's broken. And reconnect. I'm fragile, but not, not that, that fragile. fragile. <laughs> Want to come work for me? Could use a man like you. The world's still broken. Same as before. What isn't? But we're still here. We're still chugging along. Not everyone. Not me. Come on. You put America back together, didn't you? Doesn't mean there's a place for me. I've got no ties to anyone or anything. I might as well be dead. I felt like that when we first met in the cave. I still do. Don't act like you're the same person. You've learned how to touch, to feel. You've connected with people, with us. Everything I touch, I lose. Sam! Come on, Lou. One last delivery. <laughs>